If you could smell good every day, would you do it? If you could smell good every day, would you do it? Welcome back to another show of JB the Mentor. And this is the baddest show in the whole wide world. So stay locked, stay tuned, and I'll be back with another amazing fragrance for your delight. Oh uh, yeah, come on. So before we get started, please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, leave comments below, and remember to hit that bell for future notifications and reference to new material being aired. So today's special guest is by Maison Francis Kirk John, and it's called Grand Soir. And believe me, this is grand. So it's an unboxing, and it's my first. So today is a special edition. We have none other than the latest edition by Mason Francis Kershaw, and it's called Grand Swar. And today is an unboxing. So here we go. How beautiful is this? I'm in love. The first time that I tried an example of this, I was walking down the wet now, and it was love at first sniff. That's how amazing it is. Now this particular fragrance here only has four particular notes that stand out. But the one for me that does it is the vanilla and the benzoin. And somewhere within all of that, opulence and richness there's honey involved even though it wasn't mentioned in the notes it was there I feel like I stole you know something from what was it sugar bear honey? now I don't want to use this word too much but romantic sensual and very alluring describes this Matter of fact, I'm gonna go as far as saying this because I like to tie fragrances to people that are well known. This one right here, this is Obama in a bottle. It's silky, it's smooth, it's provocative, it's inviting, and it leaves you wanting more. And that's what I believe Obama is. It doesn't radiate 25 feet away from you, Right? I would say this is three to probably six feet radius. But once you get within that zone, you're hit. And once you get hit, you're stung. And once you get stung, you are just bewildered because this stuff smells so good. So this is classy. It's very delicious. Not in the sense that you should open the take off the cap and start drinking it, but it's delicious in the sense that when you walk around, you're telling yourself how good you smell, and folks are complimenting you because you smell so good. It's that kind of delicious. It's hit you over the head delicious. Now, when would this fragrance right here shine? Obviously, Fragrance shouldn't be relegated to a particular time frame. But I think a romantic setting, definitely the evening, is when this one would get five stars and really take off. You would be going to another universe if you decide to wear this fragrance during those times that I recommend it. But don't hold me to it. Whenever you want to wear a particular fragrance, you wear it. If that's the way you're feeling at that particular time. So this fragrance here has a certain saunter to it. You know what that is? That's a swag. That's the way you move, the way you walk. That's what this has to it. So if you want to fragrance it, moves and swags in a certain way, then you need to invest in this grand soir. So if you get a call from someone very special, and you want to make an impression and you want to make sure that you nail 
feel it the first time and nail it for me means Is that once they sit down in front of you, they are captured They are hypnotized They are, they just swooning Because you smell so good And then therefore, they are listening to every word that you're saying like a little puppy dog If you want that kind of experience then this is what you go out and you get. This stuff, this is a beautiful bottle and the juice that's inside of it is even more beautiful. So ladies and gentlemen, this is Grand Swap. So it's time to wrap up this special edition of my first unboxing. And like I always say, smell good every day in every way. And remember, smelling good is not an option, it's mandatory. So go out and have a smell good experience. And remember, JB, I always get my swag on. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave comments below. Hit that bell for future notifications on upcoming shows. Come on. New York, what you doing? LA, would you do it? DC, would you do it? Philly, would you do it? Shot Town, would you do it? LA, would you do it? Ohio, would you do it? Let's not forget Texas. Uh huh. <laughs>